But the Capulet's mask ball, the Montague Romeo, sneaked in and there found the love of his life, Juliet. But he had to leave the ball quickly, as he knew he would be killed for crossing the Capulet's territory. Romeo and Juliet then met again at Juliet's balcony, which is where the famous line, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo, originated from. God, it's so hot this doesn't look like my English classroom. Hello. Hi. Who are you? I'm Charlie. Charlie's a boy's name. Well, it is, but not really. It's short for Charlotte, but who's called Charlotte these days? I'm not speaking. What's your name? Romeo. Yeah, talking of stupid names. What's your surname? Romeo Montague. That can't be possible. You don't exist. Of course it's possible. No, no, you're a character in a play I'm reading in English, like, by Shakespeare, I think his name was? That's not possible. I'm here now. But that play was written in the 1600s. You are in the 1600s. You're kidding, right? I live in the 21st century. Don't be ridiculous. I'm not being ridiculous. Oh, God, this must be some sort of prank. I bet my mum would pick me up. Damn, you sick now. What is this? Look at like a break it. Break phone. Phone? Yeah. Telephone. Signal? Signal. It really must be the signal because you don't know what signal it is. I don't want to get up. I'm sleeping.
So what is with Charlie? It, it, it's a distressing story. Thousand by essay, white balcony, 